Hey what's up guys, it's iRockish. In this video I will be showing you how to jailbreak the iPod Touch 1st generation and the iPod Touch 2nd generation non NC model. Don't know which version you have? Go ahead and check settings, general, about, and then if you go down to where it says model, you can check right there where it says model for what version you have. If you have MB, you're good. If you have MC, hold off um, as current jailbreaks are being developed or my little tutorial videos if you subscribe. So for iPod Touch 3rd gen owners, you're going to have to hold off for a bit as this guide is only for 1st gen and 2nd gen iPod Touch owners like I said. Sorry for being so repetitive, but people will comment and still tweet me about the jailbreak for their device. So first off, you're going to need a couple things both which are available in the sidebar. Number one is Red Snow 0.9.4. Link is in the sidebar to download and the 3.1.2 firmware for your device. Yes, we are jailbreaking 3.1.3, but Red Snow will recognize 3.1.2 as the 3.1.3 firmware. It sounds confusing, but you'll see what I mean. So to start off, I will be using my second gen iPod Touch for this tutorial and also the first gen is the very blocky one and it's thick too so the first thing you're going to want to do is connect your device into iTunes and wait till you obviously get that version there's a little sound so once you have it connected here and in iTunes, um, what you want to, what you're gonna want to do is go ahead and hit update. Go ahead and in iTunes, go ahead and hit check for update if you're on 3.1.3 already. Leave it, but if you're not, go ahead and update it. It is safe only if you're a first gen and second gen iPod Touch owner. Then, after it's done updating, obviously mine is already on 3.1.3, you're going to go ahead and unzip the zip file that you downloaded for Redstone, and you'll have it like that. Go double click on it. There's Redstone, and it'll say, Welcome to Redstone, blah 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 blah. Please select the corresponding IPSW for your current device. Browse go ahead and choose 3.1.2 processing firmware and then it'll ask you if it's the MC model make sure if you're MC model that you tell Red Snow that it is like it says if you have an MC model and you don't correctly identify here you will likely need to do a full official restore mine is not an MC so I will go ahead and hit no then I will go ahead and hit next. All while this is connected to the computer. Now what you're going to do is you're going to select the options you would like to have. I'm going to go ahead and keep it simple and just uh, install Cydia. You can do the custom boot logos. Make sure you follow the requirements. And hit next. And it'll say, make sure your device is both off and plugged in. So it's plugged in. So now I'm going to do is go ahead and turn it off. Okay, now that is turned off. I can now go ahead and click next. And this is the part where it's going to get tricky, so I'm going to go ahead and put my camera down and do the steps all right here. So next, hold the power down, two, three, four, five, and then you're also going to want to hit the home button. And then after about 10 seconds, you're going to go ahead and release the power button, still holding the home button. All the directions are with the jailbreak in Red Snow, and if you did it correctly, 
you will now get this. You have a white screen on your device and you will have all this reloading and stuff. Waiting for reboot and downloading jailbreak data. So now it says the rest of the process takes place on your device. You can now go ahead and hit finish and close out of red snow. And now you can wait for your device to finish loading up. Remember guys, this is only for the iPod Touch 2nd gen and 1st gen. If you're on a third gen, please do not try this. I don't want to get any tweets saying that I messed up your device. Um, hope you guys read the little disclaimer in the beginning of the video. But now, once your jailbreak is over, or done, whatever you want to say, you should now see that you have Cydia. And when you tap in and go into Cydia, it'll do all its little uh, reloading and respringing stuff. Um, but yeah, that's pretty. It's pretty simple. If you guys miss a step, all the directions are in the sidebar. If uh, if that helps you better, I know in some parts of this video I rushed or um, the volume was really unclear. The microphone on this camera kind of sucks. It's only good when you're close by it. But um, but for more help. Please uh, tweet me. If you don't have a Twitter, please create one. It only takes a few seconds. And it's much easier for me to help you. But anyways, guys, that'll do it for this video. I will be making more jailbreaks for the devices. Just give me time, please. Um, I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial. For more, be sure to follow me on Twitter. Twitter.com backslash iRockish. Be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe on this video. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>